Erosion continues to affect homes, especially for some on Oahu's North Shore. KITV 4's Janila Kabir reports lawmakers and activists held a meeting this morning to come up with plans to try to stop beach erosion. There is no fighting water, especially on the North Shore. Experts say one-third of the beach homes here on the North Shore are likely to eventually fall into the ocean. Residents, along with lawmakers and scientists, are looking for ways to fight coastal erosion. The Surf Right Foundation and other groups released a report called Adaptive Coastal Management Recommendations, Actions and Strategies. It explains long-term erosion, including sea level rising and sand movement from larger waves, as well as their plans to remove sand from certain beaches. Oahu experienced record-setting sea level heights in 2020 and 2021. These measured historical rates of sea level rise are expected to accelerate around Hawaii in coming decades, following and then surpassing global average rates. The report highlights three hotspot neighborhoods on the North Shore, Sunset Beach, Laniakea and Moka Liea. Experts say coastal erosion is an issue happening now, and they're approaching this in phases, with steps such as sand management and dune restoration. There is no simple solution to this problem of coastal erosion, nor is there a single solution. It's a variety of oftentimes phased introduction of different planning options. Officials said 70% of beaches are eroding in Hawaii. And the area between Sunset Beach and Rocky Point here on the North Shore has one of the most critical coastal erosion problems. Activists and lawmakers say they have short-term and long-term goals in place to help the residents here that are affected. Reporting at the North Shore, I'm Shanila Kabir, KITV4 Island News.